hi guys welcome back to this channel this is your girl simply sue back again with another interesting video and today we are going to the market together so we are making breakfast we're making pancakes with my son Jaden, and tea and before we go to the market we're going to take some tea yeah thank you for joining us karibuni and please remember to subscribe remember to comment remember to like my video and share with your friends so let's take some tea and go to the market guys it's gonna be awesome Shine bright up all night whenever slow went down Fall in love drunk mistakes we're bound to hit the ground Gotta keep this feeling keep on breathing So guys, these are yellow beans. We're going to boil them today also. I had soaked them last night, so now they're ready to be boiled. These are yellow beans uh, for those who are prone to acidity and heartburn. So these, these are not too acidic. We're going to boil them today using a jiko, and then we'll come pack them later. This is what I'll be buying from the market today, so let's go. Shine bright up all night, whenever slow went down. Fall in love, drunk mistakes, we're bound to hit the ground. Gotta keep this feeling, keep on breathing. guys we are here we are the market already to kosokoni this is where i go to the market this is where i buy my grocery this is where i buy even clothes apa kuna nguom smart smart once i'm tush a lot of good stuff here and things are very cheap things are affordable like things you won't even imagine very affordable yeah, i'm very sure some of you know where this soko is this is Viru market Viru market it's very nice and we are going to do a video very soon to keep on your shopping here when you're doing um, tumba shopping here a lot of things actually i buy a lot of my kids clothes from here even the shoes it's, it's, imagine even the shoes i'm wearing are from this place yeah it's a good good soko so kujeni tuingie kwa soko guys this is my first stop i'm buying omena we eat omena twice a week in my house so this is my plug for omena this is where i get my weekly omena from and yeah they have all kinds of fish here but mostly I buy my omena from here. So guys, we go ahead and do our grocery shopping. We start with lemons. This is where I buy my lemons from this lady here. Uh, we buy lemons and then we buy uh, green pepper and cordets also. I also buy my beetroot from here, but today I'm not buying beetroot. I think I have them in the house. So guys, we are 
guys, I'm buying my greens here, my mboga za kienyeji, I'm buying from here. I buy terere, kunde, and managu. I also buy kanzera. And I want to try buying mrenda next time. I've never bought mrenda or eaten mrenda, so I'm going to try next time. My girl tells me she can make it for us, so I'll buy mrenda next time. We are buying cabbage how can i forget cabbage this one is a must where i come from we cook cabbage in everything in mchele in githeri in ugali yani kafish boga it is a necessity so i had to stop over for some cabbage and yeah this one is going to last me for i think i think a week and then we proceed to buy oranges i think this is the season for oranges there are a lot of them in the market and they are not so expensive imagine Shine bright up all night We're never slowing down Fall in love, drunk mistakes We're bound to hit the ground Gotta keep this feeling Keep on breathing Even if we're slipping away So I close my eyes and lose myself now Do it like it's only a day So guys, remember to subscribe in this new channel of mine this is your girl Simply so Please comment, like, and share my video. And guys, now we are done in our shopping. Let us go home and wash our grocery. So guys, now we are home. On to the washing part. I use a dishwashing soap. Hey, my coffee. Dishwashing soap to wash my grocery. And of course, I put uh, some bit of vinegar and what and running water. So this is where I wash my my everything. My I mix everything together. So I'll sort them later when they're all dry. So guys, we are done with our, wa our washing. So now I'm sorting out the onions so that I can put them under the sun to dry kidogo. I normally put my onions uh, in the sun so that they can dry up. They don't start rotting. So I also have my ngwashes, my sweet potatoes. And my beans are ready. The first ba batch of beans is ready. So I've put the second one on the fire. So now we are preparing the mbogaza kenyeji. Then we'll put in the fridge. Because we are not cooking them to, today. And so I have everything uh, where I can see it. So that when they dry up. I'm going to. I'm also going to, uh, to use I think a kitchen towel to wipe them. Then I store them when they are dry. Because now I can't wait for them to dry. And pack up tomorrow morning. I'll just wipe them with my kitchen towel. Then I, st I store them in the fridge. So I've put my second batch of beans in the fire.
So guys, I'm showing you how I steam my sweet potatoes. I don't boil them so that they don't get so soggy and messed up. So I use this uh, steaming pan for my uh, sweet potatoes, for my ngwashes, even for my chicken, for my meat. It is a very good uh, steamer to have in the house. So I just put water underneath like uh, halfway. Then I put the meshed lid. Then I put the sweet potatoes on top. Then I cover it and give it like 10 minutes and it will be ready. And you are doing chapels. And of course some tea. Tea ya sakumi. This one now is a must. A tea break. So we are having a tea break as we wait for everything to to be ready. Welcome for chapel guys. Welcome. And guys now our second batch of beans is uh, almost ready. So this is the last one. I boiled them outside my house up on Yuma. With a jig of course and a pot. And I need to get a bigger pot so that I don't boil two times. Hey, motto. It's too hot. And guys, our menas are here. So we are going to sort them or to chagua them. Then we store them in the fridge and divide them into two portions. By the way, guys, I really love tea. I don't know how many times I can make tea in a day, eh? especially in a this cold. Now our sweet potatoes are ready. Now we are about to remove them from the fire. They look so yummy. Wow. So guys, let me take this opportunity to thank you all for your support, for the love that you've continued to show me over the past uh, week we are new here on the journey to 500 subscriptions please subscribe if you haven't like comment and share with your friends so that they can also sub subscribe thank you so much and god bless you as you do that and i love you all in the love of jesus christ this is your girl simply sue and bye bye till next time